people. How you doing? Yes. Did you read the title? Well, I ordered, hey, Sandra Hazel. <laughs> Ooh, let me put my glasses on. Where they at? Oh, <laughs> Oh, Lord, okay. Oh. Hey, Rockstar. Have I been summoned because somebody's suing me? No. Mm -mm. I've never been sued. Knock on wood. Okay. But have you been summoned? Somebody's suing you, girl? Don't let it be a bill collector, okay? Because I may have been sued. I don't know. I get hey, Okay. If they sued me, I don't know nothing about it. Hey, Simply Me. Thank you guys for the thumbs up. I really appreciate it. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, let me. There we go. Yeah. I've never been. Oh, oh. Well, that if, if that's a formality. Yeah. That's a formality. Bill collector. Yeah, they say they suing you. They want you to get all... Uh, uh, disturbed, okay? You know, girl, you know the game. Yes, that's all that is, okay? Mm-hmm. Yes. Um, you know what? I was, um, I'm looking at these, uh, cases. They're talking about, um, the cruise ship. The cruise ship, okay, that, uh, they have the people quarantined on, okay? The, yeah, these fools actually went on a cruise after they seen the breakout from the coronavirus on the other cruise ship, but they decided to go ahead with the plans, okay? Now they hollering because 21 people have come down, have been tested positive for the coronavirus, okay? Now they're trying to find out how, who brought the virus on? You, you know what? Look, y'all don't know who brought the virus on because you didn't have the sense enough to test the people before they got on the ship. Okay. You know what I'm saying? And that should be something they should start. They should start testing people. Okay. For certain diseases. When they, when they, when they start getting on the um, cruise ship, getting on a plane. Okay. If you're not traveling within the United States, okay, within the country, they should have certain testing, okay, for certain diseases. You know what I'm saying? They know more about what's going on than we do. But you can really help, okay, to keep the uh, spread of any, even if there's a cure. It's not really just the point that there's a cure, but that helps. But you don't want people spreading these diseases because you, when you have people spreading things, okay, uh, depending on their body and what they do, it can get missing, screwed. The next thing you know, you got another strain. Don't nobody know how to cure. You see what I'm saying? Where I'm going with this. Okay. Now, these people on the ship, they don't know who brought the virus on it because they, like I said, they're mismanaging the whole thing. Okay. Now, there's more people that are not dying, okay, from the virus. I understand that, okay? But don't nobody want to be a casualty, okay? Especially, okay, getting a, a virus that you don't have a cure for and people are dying of, okay? So I would think that they would put more restrictions and be more uh, um, attentive to what they're doing, okay? And they're not, they're not. I mean, this is crazy. They already got two strains. Oh, Lord, they trying to wipe us out. Okay, now, my mama was telling me. She was telling me that. You see that there's nobody, okay, in Africa that got the virus. Now, I don't know, okay, uh, in the continent, okay, let me look that up. Matter of fact, while I'm at, but see, the weather is hot out there. Very hot. We're going to look it up right now. Simple question. Hey, Dinah's Views. Did you mean Corona? You know what I meant. 
Did you mean coronavirus in Africa? See, see. Algeria, Algeria. So they do have cases in in Africa. And the thing about it with Africa is that the health system out there, okay, and the poor health. So that's what's going on with Africa, okay? So if they getting it in Africa and it's rising, and you know it's hot in Africa, okay? You know, I just I thought I'd throw that out there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you for the thumbs up. I appreciate it. I really do. Okay, now let me see. Okay. Uh Got my beauty box. Ooh, it's heavy. Okay. Um, thumbs up. I think it's a bill collector. Oh, okay. Well, bill, you well, they got it. Oh, the people on that shit, they got more convincing because now they stick they uh stuck, they quarantine, they're gonna be tested, okay. And uh um they already have two strands. I gotta look that up. Hey, Angela, Dinah's View, Simply Me, Hazel's Daughter, Rockstar, Bell Button, okay. Hi. Yes. Before I start, okay, let me look. Now what I got is Target Beauty Box. You know, the funny thing, oh, 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 sheesh, okay. I almost clicked off, okay. The thing about, um, the beauty box is I was looking up on my phone when my beauty box is going to get delivered. I'm looking at the, the um, webcam because I forget that I'm on the phone. Okay. Oh, my God. Okay. Problems, okay, <laughs> of a YouTuber. But anyway, as I'm looking on my phone, okay, my cats take off. Tasha runs and hides in the closet, okay? Keisha hides. She run back to the room and then she peeking down the hall. I like, what they, what they running from? I said, you know, so I get up and I said, I wonder if somebody at the door. And sure enough, my box, they had dropped my box off, okay, at the door. But anyway, I tell you, somebody breaks in, they ain't no help. Mm-mm. Okay. Let's see. Are there two strands of the corona virus? Now we got to make sure it's 19 because we know we know, okay, that we have different strands of the coronavirus, okay? If you didn't know, yes, there are. This particular strand, okay, is different, a little different. This is called a novel coronavirus. They call it the novel coronavirus because the novel means new. It's not your normal novel as in a book, okay, but it's your novel as in another language that means new, okay. Mmm. I don't see it. Oh, wait. Why Chinese? Uh-oh. See, they, look, I'm telling you. Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. No, Bobo. Why Chinese scientists say there's a second strand? I can't even get it out. <laughs> okay. There's a second coronavirus strain. A controversial study asserts that two strains of coronavirus are circulating in China. In China. Now watch. I, okay, I'm just, I'm so. Anyway. More dangerous. Wow. So this is two days ago.
say, and why is it coming from China again? Something ain't right. Something ain't right, y'all. I got to scratch my hand. Oh, it's itching. And this ain't the right. This is my right hand. I'm left-handed. If my right hand itches, I have to pay a bill. Okay, so I'm going to pay it with my money hand, which is the left hand. If my left hand itches, I got some money. I tell you, it works. It works for me. Okay, sometimes my, let me tell you, sometimes my hand itches, my left hand itches out the sky blue. And I'm like, why my hand itches? I don't scratch it away, though. I scratch just the, the other hand away. I'm like, why am I? I didn't already got paid. I ain't expecting no money. Okay, and sure enough. Some money will fall out the sky. I call it falling out the sky. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, when I get it, okay. Yeah. When I get it, then I, you know, I know where it came from and how I got there. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But I wasn't expecting it. And uh, it probably some money coming I forgot about. Okay. Maybe I applied for a... Um, uh, uh, um, a class action lawsuit, okay, and they finally sent me $20 or something, you know what I'm saying, okay, like that, but I'm just saying it works, so it works for me, and I'm gonna keep on that track, okay, mm-hmm, hey, Simple Rican, okay, so let me show you what's in my beauty box, okay, right here, we have, oh, this is called Out of Office. I keep wanting to hold it up there. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. This is the spring box. Okay. What happened was I ordered two boxes. And usually I get them together, but this one came first. The other one is supposed to come tomorrow, I guess. Okay. So that's fine. We do another video. I wasn't even going to do a live. Okay. Now, this spring break. Okay, and you get your usual three dollars when you spend fifteen. The um, what? Wait a minute, Boo Boo. Oh, this coupon is good until June. I was just getting ready to tell you that the coupons usually expire at the end of the month. So if this is what I would consider a March box then the coupon will expire, expire March 31st. You see where I'm going with that? Okay. But this one, this one says June. Woohoo! Okay. Let me, I got to keep that one. Mm-hmm. Okay. So this is what we're looking at. Okay. And I'm going to start with what fell out. I love getting these. If you've never tried uh, Cetaphil. Okay. Cetaphil, this right here is a daily facial cleanser. They have the moisturizing cleanser. Okay. And they have the, um, scented cleanser. They have different kinds of cleansers, but Cetaphil is a really good cleanser. Okay. For your skin. Um, it's usually hypoallergenic. Okay. You can, as a matter of fact, it is, you can get it, um, unscented, but this is really good for the face. It does the job. Okay. Without being harsh. So when I get me a hold of some Cetaphil, some free Cetaphil. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Now this right here, this is some deodorant. This is some black, some rose black pepper. Okay. Now I don't know. This is hemp seed oil enriched. This is a natural deodorant and I can't really use a natural deodorant. I need an antiperspirant. Okay. Anyway. Let's see if it got pepper in it. I don't see pepper. Okay. I'm just going to. I would think black pepper. Rose plus black pepper. I, that's what I'm doing. Now, it's. It's got a funny color to it. It's got a funny color to it. Kind of like an oatmeal texture. Ooh, it's bumpy. Let me put it up some more. The sides are smooth, but 
it has a it has a smell. It has an unusual smell. It's you can smell the rose. It's it's spicy. It smells like spicy rose. Okay, that makes sense. It smells like a spicy rose. Okay, that's what it smells like. I'm just gonna put this back in here. And then we'll cover it up because I can give it to somebody who uses deodorant, okay? Uh, especially this is a natural deodorant. A sensitive skin formula. That's what it says. So I don't know, people. This is by Schmitz. And um, so you're supposed to hold this on your skin so you can soften it. I guess the heat from your skin. Some perfumes have those scents. Mm -hmm. It works. Oh, thank you. Hey, girl. She just popped off. $20. That's right. That's going to go for gas money for my grandbaby. Oh, did I tell you guys? Um, now... I also meant to mention, too, about my grandson. Thank you very much. Uh, she said I'm amazing. How cool is that? Okay. I got your message, and I was watching your video as you were mentioning my name. But what it is is that I'm watching it on my TV, so I can't respond back. But thank you very much, and I really appreciate it, okay? That was really uh thoughtful and considerate of you, Lynn. I really appreciate it. And your prayer warriors, you're right. My prayer warriors. She said, I got my prayer warriors, okay? Yes. And I just wanted, you know, to share with you guys that, you know, I was thinking, I was trying to hold myself. That's why I didn't come on today, too. I was kind of like bummed out. Now, this situation with my grandson, okay, it's going to get worse before it gets better. Okay, it's going to get worse before it gets better. And I'm just hoping that's when you have to go, when you go for cancer, okay, that's just, the, that's just the way it is, okay. The treatments really take a lot out of you, okay. And um, I have to remind my daughter because, you know, you're, 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 you're excited. Oh, he got through this and, you know, he came out like a champ and everything. OK, but this is just the beginning. This is the way it goes. OK, he's going to get sicker. OK, so I don't know how many treatments, how many sets or I call them groups, how many groups that he has to have. OK, you see what I'm saying? I don't know how many groups that he has to have to. Um, for this thing, okay? Thank you, sweetie, okay? She said another $10. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Yes, okay? Thank you. That's right. Thank you very much. He will appreciate that, okay? Um, my, uh... Yeah, right. Yeah, you're right. Okay, because this is really going to be, you know, she's already uh, ex uh, uh, shared to me that she's she's struggling. Okay, she's um, she's overwhelmed. She's scared. Okay, she's worried. Well, the, you know, all the things that come in, especially when you have a child. Okay, and so. It's, it's going to get worse before it gets better. That's just the way cancer treatments work, okay? And, yeah, so we'll see. And I'm going to uh, I don't I'm gonna ask because I don't want to overstep my browns. Do you want me to? Because this is not going to be my first rodeo, okay? So thank goodness that she has people around who are able to tell and share. But that's one thing. But having somebody that's right there, with you is another thing. You see what I'm saying? Okay. People can tell you they're going to give you information all day long. Okay. 
But to have somebody actually there to help walk you through this is it, it, it's, it's going to be a world of difference. And so I'm going to ask, you know, if she wants to show me the paperwork so I can read because there's stuff. Apparently there's stuff like that they put on there. Maybe she's not reading it or understanding because, you know, they tell you your treatment, his treatment plans. They, you know, but she, I'm pretty sure they broke it down to her. But there's a lot of stuff. OK. Not to mention going back and forth to the hospital and stuff. Luckily, the kids, okay, are in their teens. My granddaughter is going to be graduating this June, okay? She's going to be graduating. She's been two years. She's 18. My other grandson is 16. So these people are old enough to take care of themselves, okay, at home while mama's doing whatever she's doing, okay? So luckily for that, and they can help her, okay? So, yes, thank you very much. Yes, okay. So, let me finish the um, rose and pepper, okay. So, this is definitely a distinguishing scent, okay. It's, yeah, it smells spicy like a spicy rose. Yeah. So, we'll see about that, okay. Mm -hmm. And, come to find out, okay, they, they live right down the street. So I'm just putting that out there, okay. In other words, this ain't on purpose, probably. I don't know, but I'm I'm gonna absorb the blessings. I'm not gonna block my blessings, okay. Anyway, this is what I've been wanting to try. This right here. This is the Thayers. They sell. I see so much of this stuff right here at Target. This is facial mist. This is a witch hazel facial mist. Rose petal. Let's see. And now they have, uh, this is the uh, facial mist. Bell button, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All this time. All this time. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. This is in the scent Rose Petal, and this is a facial mist with witch hazel aloe vera formula. That's what it says on here, okay? Uh, let's see what it says, because um, I usually see this in, um, what do they call that water? I call it tonic water. But what's that water that's so popular? Um, ooh, um... That stuff they sell, okay, I will remember it, okay. But let me smell it. It's a light rose smell. That's what it smells like. Micellular water, that's it. They sell a lot of the micellular water, okay. So this facial mist, let's see what the, because we got the instructions or the description right here. And this right here is a unique blend of pore cleansing rose water and certified organic aloe vera cleanses, tones, moisturize, and balances the skin's pH level, revealing a gorgeous glowing complexion. I need that in my life. Okay. <coughs> okay. Don't spray too much. That's what it says. Am I glowing, y'all? Let's see. Am I glowing? Yeah, because my face is wet. <laughs> oh, wait. What was I going to I was going to say something to you, and I just forgot. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, that's what I was going to say to you, Lynn. You know that I was going to go to the store and get the ingredients for the um for the aloe vera um hand sanitizer, right? Well, apparently the WHO, the World Health Organization, okay, the WHO has given out a recipe for hand sanitizer, okay? So that same day that I hit that I responded to you, okay? Girl, I went to the store 
And these fools then wipe out the whole entire section of rubbing alcohol. 60, 90, whatever percent. The only thing that was left standing was the, um, the peroxide. Okay. There was two, two bottles of aloe vera gel. I got one, okay, because I had squirted, I made it, um, Okay, let me show y'all my concoction I made. Okay, but you're supposed to put some tea tree oil in it, right? They were almost out of that. They had two left that were not in the um, in the um, pharmacy section. They were in the beauty section, so that's probably why I was able to get it because it has to be the 100% tea tree oil, okay? Now, what did I just, I just, oh, here it is. Okay. Oh, no, this is the extra one. Okay, what happened was I couldn't find my bottles, people. I couldn't find my bottles uh, to carry. Let me see, is this in here? I'm trying to figure out what I did with my other. Okay, but I just, uh, okay, in the middle of a, um, uh, uh, a tutorial. <laughs> Don't get no better than this. Oh, look at my baby. She in the chair. But it's not in here. I got to find it. But if you don't have it, look. If you don't have a um, container, an empty water bottle will do. Okay? So I'm just putting that out there. But I did, I had a spray container. Okay? And I'm letting you know that a spray container will work. Okay? But I thought it wasn't because of the gel. So I, you got to shake it up real good and let it mix real good. But I'm going to put some drops of tea tree oil. Oh, here it is. Tea tree oil and I don't know, something else. But here's my bottle. Yep. And I was spraying my hands. Okay, so I just wanted to say thank you, okay? But when I went to the store, they was bought out. Luckily, I keep rubbing alcohol, and I use the aloe vera gel. And since I used that, I got a, um, oh, let me show you guys. I didn't show you. I bought some aloe vera gel. They had two kinds. They have the clear, and they have the green. They were all out. This was all. Two of these were left, Okay. The aloe vera gel. And then I got a 100% tea tree oil, okay? And this is uh, head to toe clarifying, okay? This is 100, you got to dilute it, okay? So, yeah. And tea tree oil is good, okay, at removing bacteria, okay? Like for your scalp, those, um, is it bacteria, viruses, uh, 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 Fungus, 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 mm-hmm, fungus, okay. So, thought I would share that, okay. Since I'm on live, I might as well make it alive, okay. Yes, so yes, and I, and I shared your video, I shared it on my page, and I also shared it on my um, Twitter, okay. Now the next thing I know, everybody's making a video, okay. On how to do hand sanitizer because Lynn did it. Okay. <laughs> See how they copy your stuff, but they ain't gonna let you know. Okay. But you know what? Nobody else doing it. Okay. But it, it, yeah, there you, you that, that there. Yeah, so I just let you know. Yeah, oh yeah, girl. I like, oh, I'm gonna make me some hand sanitizer because I seen your video. <laughs> girl, get up there and they didn't wipe it out. Luckily. I have two bottles of um, hand sanitizer. Now, let me tell you something. My friend was telling me at work, one of my coworkers, she does biology. She's a biology major. And she's saying that people are getting them. She said they're getting the 90%, 90 percent, 90 something percent. She said that's not effective. She said it's actually the 60 percent. I'm like, what? She says, yeah. She said a lot of people think because it's higher that it's going to work. She said, no. It's not going to kill the virus. She said, got to get to 60. Now, I'm like, well, the who is telling us 90-something percent. Okay. She said to 60. Girl, look, 
Look, I just so happen. Wait. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, okay. Now the other bottle. Which, oh, I have another one around here, okay? But look, this right here. This is the 91%. And where's my... And okay, so the other one I have is uh is 60. It's 60 percent. I just happened, oh, what happened was I went to the store and I I don't know what made me do it, but I had bought 60. I wasn't paying attention. And then okay, I happened to see it, and one day I'm like, 60 percent. I need more than that. So when I went to the store, I got this one, which was 91. So now I got both. Okay. Now, I spray my hands, and I don't know if it works, but it makes me feel good. <laughs> it makes me feel good and sanitized, okay? Yes. Okay, so with that said, my face feels pretty good, so we let that air, uh, air out and dry. And um, it's no stickiness. It just, just feels normal, okay? It just feels normal, okay, on that. So let's go to the next product. Hopefully it won't take a whole uh, 15 minutes. <laughs> this wasn't supposed to be like this, people. Okay. But this right, this is something, this is something new. I'll probably put this in Kim's box because I'm about to mail that, uh, close it up and mail it out uh, this week because I'll be off and I'll get that out the way. But this is not your mother's clean, freak, refreshing, dry shampoo. Now, this is something different. Okay, this is something different. I can mail you some free samples, Lynn. I just don't know when you'll get it this time, okay? Because you know, honey, girl, let me tell it. But this is a dry, refreshing, dry shampoo. It absorbs excess oils, leaves no residue, and uh, fresh volume. It says unscented, so there's no scent. Yeah, I haven't, this is something, oh. Yeah, it's oh okay. That's what it looks like, people. Yeah, there's no scent, but the bottle looks like it would have some kind of fresh scent to it. Okay, so this is unscented. Now they sent me another one. They always have this. Now people, this is coconut miracle oil dry shampoo. This is by Refresh and Restore. This is by Organics. Okay. When you're in the beauty department in um, Target, okay, I had mentioned this before, they give free samples, okay? You can ask them, this is the free sample size, okay? You can ask them if they have free samples because they're always supposed to have free samples on, the, on them, okay? I, when I was working in the beauty department, I was supposed to have free samples on me at all times, okay? Oh, what, this? No, this one doesn't have a smell, so I have no sense in me spraying it. And I'm already familiar with this. They always give this for free, okay? And a lot of people like this dry shampoo, okay? So this one right here, um, this one has a scent. Yeah. This one has a scent, but I'm just saying, um, there's a lot of versions in... Um, brands of the um dry shampoo they sent two they always send this one but this is different okay this is something new i've never seen this one i've seen the pantene one but this is this is different okay so then they sent me uh some nexus that you know nexus ain't cheap okay some shampoo and conditioner yeah and this is a protein Protein Fusion, and this is a um, Ultimate Moisture. Ooh, I love Ultimate Moisture. But my cats, I like to use this on my cats. It makes them smell good, and it makes their fur so nice and soft. As, you know, if I can hold, get them to stay in the, the sink long enough, okay? But, yeah, so this is what I got. So this is what it looks, it is, people. I got all this stuff. 
all this, okay, samples. And these are some samples. These are some, these are not just samples, but these are travel sizes. I believe that's what, um, I think the spring break, okay, and that's why they're like this. They're spring break, so you have some travel size um, um, products to take with you on your spring break, okay? So that's what this was about. Yeah, because I remember reading it online. Yeah, so they sent travel sizes. Now, I also have another box coming. Um I forget what that box is, okay? But I have another uh, beauty box coming because I ordered two. And um, I got all these boxes, okay? So what I'm going to do is I am going to pour them into one bucket or something and uh, use them because I like to use them too uh, when I'm mailing out stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and they always... Let me see. Do I have some more? Let me look at these... Uh, Oh, that was last year. Okay. Oh. Oh. I didn't see all this. Okay. But, yeah. Now, you can go um, to Target and um, once a month. Now, here's the thing with the, the beauty boxes at Target. Okay. It's first come, first serve. It's online. Okay. They usually come out at about uh, the first week. Okay. The, the end of the first week. Okay, like about, uh, I think this came the 4th. I looked on the 4th. What's today? The 7th. Oh, wow, I got them fast. Usually, I, okay, yeah. Usually, they take longer. Okay, so, yeah, they've been coming faster. But around the 4th of the month, you can go and look, depending on what the 4th falls on. At the beginning of the month, falls on the weekend, then they haven't done anything. You have to look during the week and you'll see it posted and you'll see the different beauty boxes that are up there. Now, they'll have the new ones for that month or for that um, season. Um, they may have some for the men. They may not. They don't always have the men every month. They have the beauty box every month, but not always the men's box. And then, okay, you'll also find some boxes that are left over from the previous uh, month, okay, or season. Mm -hmm. So that's why. I think, what's in here? Oh, nothing. So, yeah, so I'm going to throw this... This is an empty box right here. Yeah, so I'm going to get these boxes together. And, um, oh, I got some toothpaste, too. So, and, okay, like I was telling people before, that they, I seen a, um, that's over with. I seen a, um, A article where they were telling you to make sure that you stock up on food and you have two weeks worth of food and oh what's this buying up all the toilet paper why they buy you know they didn't buy up all the toilet paper at Walmart yeah these people didn't lost their mind they didn't bought up all the toilet paper here goes some more deodorant this is that natural native this is a natural deodorant, too. This is, you see, they got a small one here, okay? I think this is the one that was $14 a pop, okay? I'll never be buying that, so I'll use it, but I'll never be buying it, okay? $14, I, I, uh, okay, so this is what this, oh, we got Burt's Beads. I think Burt's Beads has a dry shampoo, too. Oh, we got, temper, oh, I got two, uh, toothpaste, oh, yeah. I can never have too much toothpaste, y'all. Okay, I'm looking at reminders, okay, what I have in these boxes. Mm -hmm. And this one is empty, so throw that away. But, yeah. And the thing about this is, too, is that just like I said, traveling, this comes so much in handy, people, okay, for traveling and everything. It is really convenient. Uh, where is it? Wait. wait. Oh, wait, what did I do? It? Oh, Lord, I didn't lost my coupon. And you know I blame everything on the cats. Yes, I think I stuck it back in here because, I, oh, I was reading it. Mm -hmm, I stuck it back in there. I blame everything on the cats until I remember. <laughs> 
Yes, okay. The panic was starting with groceries, okay. Um, uh, yeah, the, they was uh, showing the whole uh, shelf at Walmart of uh, the toilet paper. They didn't wipe out the toilet paper, okay. Now, I don't have to worry about toilet paper, okay, because I always stock up on toilet paper and paper towels anyway and that reminds me okay when you're washing your hands okay use a paper towel to wipe to dry your hands off okay uh even at home even at home try to use a paper towel okay to wipe your hands off that's what all i'm saying you know but yeah they're buying it up left and right they going crazy people oh my god i'm just like sheesh Woo wee! I'm looking at um. Yeah, simply me. They, I know that's what I, I, I that's what I said too. But they're buying out. They wiped out the toilet paper. Yeah, that's crazy. But they're yes, they're going. You know because they're supposed to have a um. But two is. You know, uh, they sw I heard that and price they 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 got the pri the uh, face mask and the um, hand sanitizer hostage girl. They putting a ransom out. <laughs> they putting a ransom out. Okay, goodness gracious, pasta rice. Oh really? Well, I'm gonna go get me a bag of beans. Okay, mm -hmm. and that's because I want to make some chili. But sheesh, yes. Yeah. I mean, it's a two, it's supposed to be for a two week quarantine. Okay. You know, and that's if you come down with the virus. Okay. If you come down ill, you know, they want you to stay. Okay. Now they have apparently released the, um, testing kits. Okay. Now they said they've only released 2000, 2000. That ain't even, that's not even a colder. That's not even a corner. Okay. 2000. And then they're talking about a shortage. Okay. On the test kits. These people, you know, this is why it's making me think it's a setup. Okay. Because the management, the handling of this is just blows your mind. I mean, mishandling, mismanagement, whatever you want to call it. It blows my mind. Okay, I mean, you might as well forget stocking up. You might as well forget it all and just live your life. Live your life, okay? If you're going to die, you're going to die, okay? If you're going to get the virus, you're going to get the virus because at the rate these people going, the main ones that's probably going to get it is the ones that's buying up all the stuff. You're supposed to have extra toilet paper supplies at home anyway. Yes. Yes. The first person thought to be reinfected is on record. They don't even know. They, you know what? They grasping at straws. They don't know. They're telling you how to do this and how to do that. And I'm telling you people, they don't know. They're only doing it so that they can look like they're in control. Okay. And so that we don't panic. But we didn't already panic because they didn't bought up everything. Okay. What's left, I guess. Okay. I'm just like, well, honey, I don't, I don't know what to say. I, I'm, I'm, at, I'm at a loss for words. What's that? Paracetamol. Paracetamol. I don't know how they how it's pronounced. Paracetamol. It's probably paracetamol. That sounds more pharmaceutical. What's that? Paracetamol. Tell us all. Inquiring minds want to know. Yes. 
So don't forget to use the paper towels, okay? Uh, to use paper towels to dry your hands. And you don't have to get the selected size, okay? So you don't have to use a whole big old sheet. You just need a little, a half a sheet to dry your hands. Especially if you're using Bounty. Because it's extra absorbent. You're welcome. <laughs> Headache meds. I need some headache meds anyway, okay? Be regardless. Man. See, I need meds just for this band that's squeezing my big old head. Okay, and I'm trying to be cute, but, uh, yes, this is tight. That's probably why it was in the, um, it was in the bucket in there. Yeah, but they done lost their mind. So there's two strands out. Um, now, now, when did this... Well, they're not um, elaborating on this. Okay, there's a SARS CoV two, according to okay, it's a um, it's a different strand of coronavirus. Okay, but it's not like it's a new strand. Okay, it's not a novel. Okay, the novels are new, and this was posted last month. Okay, so the one that everybody's panicking about is the coronavirus. Yeah, so we're talking about COVID-19. The one you're talking about, that other strand, is a SARS, okay? So, yeah, they got this stuff trending all over, okay? This too shall pass, okay? And we're going to all be laughing at ourselves, okay, about how we, ooh, we, but okay. Nevertheless, we need to keep that same energy because here's the thing. If we had that same energy before all this stuff took place, we wouldn't be so uh, infected. Well, yeah, that's what well, that is what it is. OK, they want to make sure. Well, because the toilet paper, you got to have some toilet paper. OK, but my thing, that's just the way I've always been. And people always say that about me. OK, is I have I like to stock up on stuff. OK, toiletries. OK, so toiletries I stock up on. OK, now. So. My uh, uh, hand said I got to go get some more on the hand. Um, so. Hand soap, okay, because I like to put them on the um, sink, okay, where it's easier. And then I have the regular soap, okay, in the bathrooms. You see where I'm going with this, okay? And in each room, okay, where there's a sink to wash your hands. And people need to understand there's a lot of misunderstanding, okay, that's going on because of this. And people need to understand, too, is that... Yeah, you know what? They said that you're right, just Pauline. They said that at my job, that they, you know, at my job, they like, oh, it doesn't matter. Oh, it doesn't. Well, if that's what they want to do, okay. But now, she said we have a limit, okay. Ours is six, okay. I don't know. I just ring the stuff up. I'm not counting. I really am not, okay. But um, two is that it's gonna put a strain on the um stores because. 
you know, we're going by history here, okay? And this right here is not the history. So now we're out. We're not going to get any more until some is dropped off. We don't know when they're going to be dropping it off. We get shipments, but they said they don't know what's really on the shipment, okay? I think we get two shipments per week, okay? And so we clock it in as we get it, okay? So, yeah. So on the limit for the wipes. Yeah. Well, I've gotten some wipes. I gave my daughter most of the wipes because I still have some. See, I have a lot of stuff that I don't I don't even use. I could just bust that open. OK. And um, I gave her some. Uh, they were on clearance. They happen to be on clearance and um, they were the scrubbing bubble wipes which is good, okay, good to have uh, some scrubbing bubble wipes, okay, now, okay, and if we keep that same energy, people, um, we won't be spreading a lot of germs, okay, we really won't, we won't be spreading germs, and we won't be catching germs, people, they, they need to keep that, y'all, we need to keep this, after this is all over, we need to keep that same energy, because had we had that energy before, all this coronavirus and all this spreading and stuff, it wouldn't be spreading as rapid as it is, okay, even though, what's that? Oh, that's my hair. I thought it was a piece of straw. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> I look like some straw. <laughs> but if we keep that same energy, okay, we can prevent a lot of this stuff from spreading in the, in the first place. Okay. You know what I'm saying? And then, too, as far as that hand sanitizer, stop, still, stop, stop, uh, uh, swiping the whole shelf of say hand sanitizer because here's the thing. Okay. Hand sanitizer helps. Okay. But it's not. The, it doesn't take the place of washing your hands. And here's why, okay? Because when you wash your hands, you get water and all that soap gets all in your nails and all in the crevices and stuff like that, okay? When you're spraying it, you're wiping your hands down, you're just doing a gentle wipe. But when you got that water and that soap and you, you're doing that, you're really getting it, it really getting down into the necessary places. But that little spray, that little uh, uh, hand sanitizer, you squirt a little bit and rub your hands and stuff it feels good okay but it doesn't take the place of actual soap and water and washing your hands oh you use the order online and pick up in the store well you know pauline you can do we got pull up now you don't even have to go in the store you can uh we got pick up yes and there's a, a stall there's a, a a red um a red pole that says pick up and you pull in there and somebody will bring your order out. But it has to be on the pick. It has to be pick um, um, drive up. Excuse me. Drive up. Not pick up, but drive up. Uh huh. And I took advantage of that. And that's really convenient if you're in a hurry. Um, uh, you don't want to uh, spend your time going in the store. You don't want to spend extra money. Girl, order that stuff on the drive up, pull up in that spot, and somebody will come out, scan your phone, okay? Make sure we got the right person, and, and put your stuff in, in the car. Yeah, that's pickup. That's pickup. Going into the store is pickup. That's convenient too, okay? But now we have drive up, so you don't even have to go in the store if you don't want to. You know, and that will cut down germs too. Mm -hmm. Yes. You're welcome, Bell Button. I like to be positive. I mean, you could be negative or you could be positive. Okay. You know. You ordered what? Oh, for the lungs? Oh, so it helps as an inspectorant. Now, an inspectorant is that is this is what causes you to cough up, okay, the mucus, okay, that's in your lungs that can uh, cause bronchitis and uh, pneumonia. That's what she's talking about, people. Let's look this up. How much it costs? 
I haven't heard of it. Oh, I didn't spell it all wrong. Okay, let me see. Oh, M U. There we go. Oh, they got it in the T too. They have it in a T. It's a flower. They have it in the herb or oil. Let's check out this tea. I never heard it. Now, see, this is the, this is the kind of stuff. This is not just because there's a virus outbreak, but this is gonna help you in general. Okay. Mm -hmm. Verba scum. Commonly known as Moline is a genus of about 360 species of flowering plants in the figwort family. They are native to Europe and Asia with the highest species diversity in the Mediterranean. No, they don't. Oh, breathe deep. Oh, they got it at Walmart. This this bottle, oh. Why they gotta show everything like it's weed? That show look like some weed. I don't know what it I don't know what the weed looks like. Okay. Anyway, so uh they have it in a herb, a yoga tea. No, I know. No, uh, Walmart doesn't have it. It's somebody else that has it uh, dried up. Oh, you know what this is? Okay, I know what it is. It's loose tea. That's what it is. Well, it looks like weed to me. But anyway, it's loose tea. That's why it looks like that. Okay. They want $15. You get a pack of four. Yeah, that's what it is. It's loose tea. <laughs> See, I, I, you got to watch me. I'll start a rumor in a minute. Ciao. Now they didn't came up with some organic peanut butter. Okay. Boy, I tell you, they try to sell stuff so much. Now I heard of that Tazo. This is oh, oh, okay. It is a four pack with a total of 64 bags okay so each bag contains 21 tea bags okay well now I, okay now i can see the 20 the 15 dollars i'm like 15 dollars it's a caffeine free herbal supplement supports respiratory health Ooh, we don't have none at uh target so i can get a discount mm. it didn't show up so probably not Let's see if they have any in the store. Next day delivery. Well, herbs with proper. Well, see, you got to, you know, uh, Lynn, the thing about it is the stuff that, they, that we're using is coming from the earth. OK, it's just being put in different forms. OK, and you're right. Uh, we're not in the habit of using herbs like that. In other countries, they're more um, apt to use a herb. Okay, we're not. We're so used to, you're right, popping pills. So that's pretty interesting. I didn't know. So that's like a, um, a mentholatum. You're right. It comes in a brown bottle. Let's see how much they charge it. Now, when you say it comes in a brown bottle, are you talking about the drops, the oil? Yeah. 
Yeah, because I see I herb. Right, it's a dropper bottle, right. Okay. This right here, okay, let's check it out. It's alcohol free. 2,000 milligrams. Oh, you ordered yours already? Oh, they have two. They have, um, well, they have, uh, it's one fluid ounce. And this right here, uh, oh, people getting a lot of business. I'm trying to, the suggested use as a dietary supplement, take it one to two milliliters. Um, what? Oh my God. Are you serious? Oh my God. Ginger. Yeah, that is good to know if you're struggling. That's what I'm saying. It's funny how this epidemic is bringing out a lot of information on um, stuff we already need help with. <laughs> Okay, so the only other ingredients in here is vegetable, glycerin, and purified water. Okay. And... This is um, and it's gluten free in case anybody wants to know. Now this, the one you're talking about in the dry, in the uh, dropper bottle is uh, a dietary supplement. Okay, so somebody answered here, can a four-year-old take this and what is the dosage, okay? And somebody replied that the dosage for an adult is one dropper full in a little juice or water. So if you're going to give it to a young child, you're going to do half of that dropper or less, depending on the... Um, I would even use maybe a third or a fourth of the chopper if it's because she said a four year old. And um, oh, the lady got it for her dog. She got it for her dog for respiratory issues. OK, so that lets you know you can use it on animals. That's good to know. See, because it's expensive taking your animals to the vet. Yeah. For respiratory issues. I'm going to get some for my cat. Because I be hearing her breathing. Yeah. Now, the people are saying they're giving it five stars, but they're, it's, they're saying that it's too soon to see results. So I don't know. 
Okay, now they have they have I like to see okay, where was I? I like to see when people give one stars. Hey Katie, thank you very much, girl. That that that's right. Every little bit helps. Yes, I appreciate that. Oh, they got it on target. Oh, I'm going to go me order some. Girl, Landon got us started. Yes, it does help. Every little bit helps, even if it's just a dollar, because it adds up. Every little bit helps. Yes, because like I said, you know, she may not recognize it now, but because of what I've experienced, okay, it's only going to get worse before it gets better. So we're going to see how it goes. And I'm going to keep you guys updated because I know you're nosy like that. See, you get it from me. See? Yeah. Okay, but I know your concern and thank you. Mm -hmm. Yes, every little bit helps. Now the shelves were empty for what? Girl, I know, isn't it something? And you're just going to get you a couple of hand sanitizers? They didn't wipe the stuff out. The main, I, Okay, let me show y'all. See, y'all think I'm playing, huh? Y'all think I'm playing? I'm going to show you my, uh, my little collection. It's just a small collection here. Okay, my, this is my starter kit. Okay, let me show you what I'm starting. And, okay, I already have two of these. I bought two more, okay, just in case. Oh, you know what I wanted to show you guys? Now, hopefully they don't buy this out. This right here, I just picked this up. This is new. Now, on the Target app, well, they had a $2, um, a two dollar off coupon, okay? So I'm pretty sure you can go maybe to uh, coupons.com or look. This is the power wash, okay? And you just spray this into your dishes, okay? Like if you got a few dishes in the sink, see what I'm working with, okay? I got a few dishes in the sink, okay? And all you do is just spray that in there. I just use one spray, okay? See, you spray it in there, and that's what it looks like, and you wash it out, okay? And then what I'll do is I'll actually use it on something else in the sink. I only got three, well, three dishes in the sink. Right, okay, but this is dish soap. Okay, and what I'm saying is, okay, if you got a few dishes or something like that, or you can wash it real quick, you can just spray this in there, okay, and give your and and, and clean it out without having to make a whole sink of uh, dishwater, is what I'm saying. And okay, um, I've been using it, and um, you only need one squirt, okay, and you can wash more than one item, okay, with it. And I'm gonna go get some more because here's the thing. That thing cost $4.99. I'm glad I had a coupon, okay? Now, why did they have the... I didn't see them at the store because these were on the end cap, okay? They had one, a package with that bottle I just showed you, and then they had a refill. Why the refill $3.99? This is $4.99, but the refill is the same size, 16 ounces, just like the bottle. So now... My point is, okay, together, they only cost eight something. Matter of fact, I'm going to go online and I'm going to order that. But let me show you my little uh, starter kit here. Okay. I showed you guys this before. And look, okay, let me show you. See, I didn't even know I had an extra uh, package of um, toilet paper up here, okay? I have my... Um, my dish is upside down, but this is the uh, Pyrex, uh, the glass with the plastic top storage containers that I got for Black Friday, okay? And here is my starter kit, okay? And this was before the virus, okay? But this right here is toilet paper. That's toilet paper. Those are paper towels, okay? Here's some more of my dish soaps, okay? And I have, um, oh, I have some paper plates. Some paper plates, okay, right down here, and let's see. And um, this is what I was talking about, clearance. This is the Windex wipes, 
And let's see, I had a, um, oh, I okay, it's in the, okay, I got two of those, Windex wipes. So that's for when I'm doing videos, okay? I got some aluminum foil, okay? I have my toilet wand, okay, refills. And it's just a little something, something, okay? But it helps. And that's just like, that's just me. This is just me. Okay, this is just me. I like to have stuff. So just in case, I don't know where it comes from that I do that. But um, let me see, did I stop? I didn't store anything in here yet. So this is just stuff, okay, that I have. Um, oh, and there's, um, oh yeah, here it is. I have started storing, okay. Here is a, um, a throw blanket that I bought for Black Friday. And here is the um, the um, plastic containers that were only $7,699 from Black Friday. Yeah, they, I, uh -huh, I'm telling you. Yeah, they're out. And then this is what I'm going to get into because I have my Bible. Now I found, this is my Matthew Henry's commentary of the Bible. Now the commentary, okay, explains the Bible, okay? And what this is, is you look up the, the, uh, the book, what book you're in, the chapter and the verse. It has the whole entire Bible, okay, from start to finish. But what it is, is that this is the interpretation, OK, it's an interpretation of the Bible and it gives you more depending on what it's saying. OK, what part of the Bible, what you're reading. Oh, for my cats. OK, for my cats. Move, Keisha. OK, we showing the business now on my cats. I bought I'm going to buy more because I buy the big bags, but these were on sale. And so they got some beyond simply uh, cat food. And then I just bought them this. I don't even normally get these bags, these size bags. OK, but they were on sale. OK, and so I got that. Look at them just being nosy. What, what, what do you see? What are you guys looking for? Okay, it's just something that they can be in there. So I'm going to start studying too. I want to start studying my, my Matthew's Henry commentary of the Bible. And I got this from a Christian bookstore. They uh, gifted it to me. Okay, and then for my cats. Okay, oh, let's come over here. I got um, two two uh, things of the kit litter, cat litter, okay? Now, Target has a sale going on. It's going to start tomorrow. If you look, now, I don't know if you guys are familiar, okay? Now, this is the bag. This is the bags I usually buy. This is the third bag, and I'm finally gotten to the third bag. So now I'm going to buy two more big bags, okay? Mm -hmm. So this is what's going to start tomorrow. Oh, those cats are in there. Anyway, if you go on um, Target's website, on uh, the sale, okay, every Sunday, the new ads come out, okay? Every Sunday, a new sale starts, okay? And what you can do, okay, and a lot of people don't know this, is that on Friday and Saturday, you can actually pull up their site and get a sneak peek, okay, at next week's ad. Oh, it's holding up the robot floor cleaner, girl. It's the bomb.com, girl. And it's going to be going off, okay, again at 12 o'clock because we didn't hit the, the, um, I don't know how Keisha set off that, uh, that, um, that program, okay, but it goes off about right before 12 o'clock midnight, every night, okay, if I don't feel like hearing it, I'll just send it back home, but yeah, it's holding up pretty good, and now, I noticed that uh, you got to keep that thing, um, 
If you want it to work properly, you got to turn it over and make sure that you get the, the hair and dust that's uh, rolled up in the rollers, you know, clean it out and stuff like that. And it helps to uh, maintain and to work properly. Mm -hmm. But I love it. I love it. I mean, that I am so glad I invested in that. I really am mm -hmm. because I just let it go. Okay. Now, if you wanted to specifically do something, you can use the remote and program it and do it. I mean, uh, and, and guide it, but it will clean up vacuum your, your floor and the hardwood floors. Okay. So I don't have a problem anymore. I put on my clothes and if my pants hit the floor, they don't come up with dust on them. Okay. You see what I'm saying? Mm -mm. No more, no more. Mm -mm. Nope. Not anymore. I'll be like, oh man, I got to dust it off. Mm -mm. Nope. That's how, that's how good they work. That's how good they work. Mm -hmm. It's definitely a good investment. Okay. So now let me see if we have this at, uh, cause, oh, there are some other stores, but I don't see Target on here. Um, but you know what? Oh, okay. So what I was saying about the, uh, the ad. Okay. So you can get a sneak peek at the ad. Okay. Usually on Friday nights. Mm -hmm. So before you go shopping on the weekend, okay, you may want to wait till Sunday, you know, so that's how you check to see what's what, because the ad comes out on Sundays. That's when the sale starts. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. And two is next week. I mean, Sunday. Today is Saturday. So tomorrow. Okay. They are going to start a, um, $10 off if you spend 40 and $15 off if you spend 60 on cat food. Thank you, Bathsheba. Thank you. I really appreciate that. You know, I have my cash app in the description there too, you guys. My cash app. Mm -hmm. If you use the cash app, yeah, it'll probably be more beneficial, okay? But yes, I appreciate it. However, Super Chat is easy. Yes. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I haven't used a cash app before. Well, I did use it one time to see if it worked with my daughter. But um, yes, thank you very much. I really appreciate that. Yes. Mm-hmm. It sure is. Yes. Yeah, look at, uh, did you see my cash app is on there, isn't it? It should be in the description. If not, let me put it up here. Okay, because we don't, yeah, since, yeah. It is. That's my cash app. Oh, wow, my name came up. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> That's the cash app. It came up. Okay. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then my PayPal is, I think uh, PayPal is pay pal dot me forward slash C H U three, four, five. Oh, Oh, wait. Okay. There you go. Okay. I, I hit something. Is that? Mm-hmm. Yes, and yes, and like I said, your monetary donations will be going toward uh, eating the proper fruits and vegetables that he needs. Now, my concern is with this situation is um, on, the another, on the second treatment, like I said, it gets worse before it gets better. He's eating now, okay, but if he gets another treatment, because that's how chemo works, you get the, you get the, you get the first two weeks of treatment, okay, before you really start winding down and feeling tired and um, not being able to eat. And they always keep telling you to eat, 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 eat. But yet they're giving you something to make you nauseated and not eat. I, anyway.
So we'll see how that goes, and I'll keep you updated and uh, informed. Oh, and now we're going, yes, Anna Aries. Oh, oh, wait, the number didn't come in. What happened? Oh, the number locked. I'm sorry. Oh, uh-uh. Okay. Yeah, it's right there. I see it. Yeah, that's my address. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, y'all. Okay, I just can't win for losing here. I didn't have my number. Um, the number lock was on. Was not on. There we go. Mm-hmm. That's what that is. Oh, okay. Yeah, because I'm like, uh, something wasn't right, but I finally figured it out. Okay, wait, wait. No, let me get distracted from my mullet. Okay, so we are going to do a Target. Does Target have it? Um, and see. Oh, they got the T. What? Wait, let's see. Oh. No, they don't have it. They got the turmeric. They got all that tassel. Yeah, they have been saying that, though. I noticed that. So, Tazo, is that a brand? That's the brand. But I don't see where it has... Now, Spearmint might be something good for... Um... But the thing about it is... Um... The spearmint tea is not as um, concentrated. So, no, they don't have it at uh, Target. It came up, but they sure don't. Oh, they must be looking for it. Mm -hmm. Oh, sooky, sooky now. But, yeah, so this weekend... You get $10 off if you spend $40 on um, pet food, on pet food and supplies, okay? So that means that you get $40, uh, if you spend $40, okay, they're going to take $10 off. You spend $30, okay? And if you have a red card, you get your 5%. If you're an employee, you get your 10%. If you have any coupons, okay, or... Um, Circle offers on any of your pet foods. Make sure you include that and you scan it at checkout because that counts too. Okay. And see, the thing about it is you also need to know that it is $40 before taxes. However, your coupons or anything you have in your circle that's going to be deducted doesn't come out yet. You see what I'm saying? So you still get credit for that $40. They're going to take your $30 off and anything, any coupons you have. It's all going to come off. Mm -hmm. So, yes. And let me show you. Okay. Let me, we're going to go back here. Let me, oh, wait. No, we're not. Here we go. I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. Okay. Let me get my coordination here. Okay. Right here where it says weekly ads. Okay. I'm going to show you what it looks like so you can get familiar. Today is Saturday. This doesn't come out till Sunday. See the weekly ad? Okay. Wait. Oh. It's already here. Okay. So it's already out, people. It's already out. Okay. From 8 to the 8th to the 14th. So that's Sunday. Okay. That's Sunday. So I guess today is too late. Oh, it's 10 o'clock at night. That's why. Okay. So view the weekly ad. And here's where I'm going to come across. 
Okay. Oh, and by the way, if you want to uh, get you some uh, savings on some spring clothes uh, stuff. Now, I just showed you those plastic containers. Look, it's $17.99. I only paid $6.99 Black Friday. Okay. So let's see. We're going to go. I'm going to show you the ad. And this is tomorrow, people. Okay. Um, blah, blah. Here we go. $10 off, 40 or more. And then we have $15 off, 60 or more. Okay. So remember, okay, and more. Okay. So if you spend $50, you're only going to get $10 off. Okay. These are all the little goodies right up here, right up here. Cat kitty litter. Okay. I mean, uh, yeah, kid litter, dog food, cat food, okay, um, toys, pet toys, pet treats. Yes. So let me see if there's any dis uh okay, now you're gonna find this in your wallet. That means that it's already there. If you have the target.com on your um phone. If you have that app on your phone. Okay. I don't know what I clicked on. Okay, I'm trying to click on this ad. Nope. Okay, so I can't really see it right now. But anyway. In your wallet. When they say in your wallet, that's right there in your Target app. Okay? And you're going to go to the wallet. And there's going to say um, extra coupons. You're going to touch that extra coupons. And that's where you're going to see those coupons there that they're, I just showed you. Mm -hmm. That's where they are. Okay. So you every time, every, if you have the Target app on your phone, you already have the, um, the savings. Okay. On your phone. You just have to go in there and pick out what you want. You see what I'm saying? You have to go in there and pick it out. Do you want this coupon? So if you uh, if you meet the criteria and you scan that barcode, it'll come out. So that's how that works. It's really easy. Okay. Yes. And I really appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Oh, you know them fur babies, yeah. So I was just telling you that. Oh, yeah, you're right. The time change. That's not this week, though, is it? No, not no, not tomorrow, the 12th. You said the 12th. That's, wait. Mm -mm. Hold on. Okay, I don't know what I did with that phone. It's around here somewhere. Let me see the time change. You're right. It can't be the, today is March. It can't be the 12th. Did she say? At 2 a.m. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, y'all just started some more mess. Oh, it is tomorrow. Hot damn. Ooh, chow. So that's tonight. What? Oh, it's a good thing. I would have been, oh, wait, I'd have been too early for work, y'all. Or would I have been late? Oh, I don't know. It's too confusing. But anyway, we spring forward. So that means that I got to go change my clock tonight. I got to go change my clock right now on my wall. Say, because it don't matter what, when you change it, it's still going to be the right time. So we're going to spring forward on my clock.
That's what we gonna do. Mm-hmm. is it Oh, by the way, this is the second box. I bought two. <laughs> this is a limited time. Strawberry Twinkies. Okay. Let me tell you. They are not in the regular aisles with the Twinkies. You have to go in the seasonal section on the other side of the store, and that's where you're going to find the Twinkies. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, so March 8th, which is tomorrow, mm -hmm. spring forward and fall back. And the next change in fall is going to be November 1st. Right after Halloween. Right after Halloween. I know it's after Halloween, but this is right after. So if Sunday is November 1st, that means Halloween is going to be on a Saturday, October 31st. So y'all go have y'all fun. Come back and set your clocks, fall back. Mm-hmm. So now it's going to stay daylight longer. Y'all going to be wondering why you're tired. And just when you get used to staying up, it's going to be ready to change your, your clocks back. <laughs> Story of our lives. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's right. I had no idea either. I forgot about it. I, I knew it, but I, I forgot. I forgot completely because I remember I was looking on my at my calendar on my phone. And you know how they have the little dots. And I'm like, what's this dot? This ain't no holiday. And it was uh, daylight savings, whatever they want to call it. Yeah. And that's tonight. So for you guys who didn't get the memo, if you like me. Okay, and you didn't get the memo. Here's your memo. Okay, tonight, short notice, set your clock forward an hour. Okay, the house clocks. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's right. Mm -hmm. You're very welcome. Thank you. That was who? Uh, uh, Beth Sheba, who brought this? Uh, Cheryl Lee. Somebody. Everybody talking about it. Okay, where was I? But you're right, Beth Sheba, covering your mouth, uh, uh, covering your mouth should have been a, a habit with the cold and the flu. Well, you know, your mom and your daddy uh, teach you to cover your mouth when you call. And you sneeze, cover your mouth, even if you ain't got a cold. Okay. You got grown folks. See, people, people, they don't want, mm -mm. no ma'am. <laughs> As men Pam would say, no ma'am. <laughs> I'm telling you. But I'm going to have to get off of here because I have to go to work tomorrow. And I'm going to be here tomorrow afternoon with a, a look. Okay, I don't know what room I'm going to be in, but I will be doing another makeup look. And I need to, I keep forgetting to wash, uh, I said I'm going to wash my um, 
my magnetic lashes and see how that works. Okay. Yeah, folks lately, yeah. Mm-hmm. They and then okay, the thing about it, what's up with these folks killing their kids? They don't even they just killing the whole family. They don't want to get a divorce. They not remember, okay, they ain't been getting a divorce, they've been killing the spouse. Okay. Now they just killing the whole family. Just kill the whole family. <laughs> yeah. So change your clocks, people. Clocks go forward. Spring forward, fall back. That's how you know, okay? So you spring forward, you put you put your clock forward one hour, and in the fall, you put it back. Fall back one hour. That's how you remember. Somebody told me that. Never forgot it. Mm -hmm. Okay. So thank you for uh, the donations. I, I'm just, thank you. Really, thank you. Okay. It's greatly appreciated. It really is. Okay. And it helps. Every little bit helps. So if you can't do it, don't want to do it, that's fine too. I understand, honey. Okay. I ain't mad at you. Okay. But if you haven't subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button. Okay. That's what you do. That's what you do. Thumbs up this video. That's what you do. That's what you do. But most of all, stay blessed. Bye.